Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review on this hair. This hair is from Hermosa Hair on Amazon. Um, so if you want to see the deets on this hair and my thoughts on this hair, then make sure to just keep watching. If you are new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification down bell down below. Without further ado, let's get started. So this is the Hermosa hair on Amazon. I don't think that they have a direct link for a website however I know that they are on Amazon. This is their Brazilian straight hair. Um, I got a 22, 24, 26 inch with a 20 inch closure so it's four bundles in a closure. I ordered this hair on August 18th and the reason I ordered this hair specifically one because I had been doing um I had like done research on the hair but two I needed that hair the same day this was right before my birthday and I wanted to be able to take photos and everything all of that and um this hair I ordered on August 18th and I received it the night of August 18th because it is Amazon I was able to get same day shipping and because of the amount that I spent they get uh, I got same day shipping however this is not the case for everybody I do live in New York City so it's a little bit easier for them to access me because of where the Amazon um like warehouse is so that's why mine was same day I don't know if it would be the same for other cities or smaller cities if they have one day or two Two day shipping but mine did come in um the same day which was absolutely great that's what i needed because i needed time to make the wig and also to take photos all of that so that's kind of one of the main reasons why i purchased this hair i said i got this hair so i got this hair in august so this is basically like a six month review and i wanted to take time to actually like wear the hair and actually see how it does and withstand whenever I buy hair I want to make sure that this hair is going to last me at least a year or two like because I like throwing one in different wigs and stuff like that so I want to make sure the hair lasts so that's why I am doing this review so late I didn't do an initial review just because I honestly at the time I didn't think about it because it's like oh I don't know how long I'm gonna have this hair but after a while I was like okay I'm gonna have this hair for a while so I want to make sure that I do a review on it um I did get the four bundles in a closet which was the 22 24 26 and 28 I spent hundred and ninety eight dollars it was hundred and ninety eight dollars and 14 cents that I spent on this um, the taxes were sixteen dollars so originally it would be hundred and eighty one dollars plus tax made it hundred ninety eight dollars which to me is not super expensive considering that it is four bundles of longer lengths and a closure I thought that that was you know within reason of a budget I know that there are some companies that are on um, AliExpress that are a little bit cheaper and on Amazon that are a little bit cheaper however I wanted to make sure that I was getting something that I had researched and had heard good reviews on and that could also get there the same day so I was my options were a little bit limited but I wanted to make sure that it was decent here so let's just jump into the pros and cons of this hair because I don't want to take too long and I'll also kind of show the link so um, pros on the hair it's pretty decent hair again it was $198 you get what you pay for for. it was also on Amazon so you get for what you pay for however it's really not bad hair um, it's I mean it still has you know great luster to it the shine is good I actually haven't washed this hair it's been a little while since I washed the hair so I watched the hair at the beginning or kind of like mid-January however for basically the whole month of January and half of this month or the couple of days into February I've been wearing my natural hair so I have not been wearing this wig so I washed the wig and I had curled it for an event but I didn't wear it after that so I only wore it for one day so I was like there's no need for me to wash it again because I just washed it and I've only worn it once so it technically has been almost a month since I've washed this hair however I only wore it once within the past month so yeah that's why it still has a good shine um i did straighten this hair again the natural um the natural like pattern of this hair it is straight hair however when it is wet it does have just a little bit of a wave to it like when it gets wet and it dries it doesn't dry like bone straight of course of course you have to blow dry it and um straighten the hair but for the most part it's not like super big poofy anything like that um i have since cut this hair um just because one of the main cons i feel of this hair is that it does definitely shed um 
it baby this hair sheds and I even actually on this unit I had sealed the wefts because I haven't sealed wefts in for a, a while but I was like this is Amazon hair I don't know how it's gonna go so I'm gonna seal a weft this hair shed when I say it shed it shed to the point where I had to cut the ends of the hair it was a 28 inch um after the shedding I was like this is uneven so I cut it so right now it's probably to about mm, I'd say this is about a 24 to 26 inch for me when I originally got the hair I'll place a picture I took it in my this hair was from my birthday photo that I took on Instagram so I can place the picture either here or here or whatever for you to see but the hair was pretty long I mean it touched my butt I'm about five seven and a half five eight so longer it takes a little bit longer length to actually be able to touch my butt I know people are probably like oh we thought you were shorter than that no I'm actually fairly tall I'm about five eight um so it did touch like the top to not even the middle of my butt um but now it touches of course above my butt kind of like not even mid back like a little bit lower than my mid back um but this hair this hair does shed so definitely keep that in mind it's not a lot of tangling I did make this into a wig so this is a wig um, this is actually a glueless wig I have an elastic band in the back um, and I just put a little bit of got to be um, spray to kind of like lay it down um, but yeah this is not glued down or anything this is I just have spray on underwear so I can take it off whenever I want to although I did sleep in it last night um, just because I felt like it I went ahead and wrapped it up but I don't get any really not too much tangling in the back if I let it go for a while and not brush it like it'll it'll kind of tangle up a little bit I do work out every day um and when I was wearing this hair every single day because again this is the first day I've had the hair back on um when I was wearing the, ha the hair every single day I would have to brush it out after I worked out because I would be sweating and stuff so it would get a little bit matted in the back um but for the most part it doesn't really tangle much um it's pretty good hair the only thing about this hair is it does shed so definitely keep that in to take that into consideration um I did cut the wefts when I was making the wig I did I double wefted um but I did have to cut the wefts so that could play in part of it you know shedding as well but I feel like it's been months and for it to still be shedding because when I say homegirl sheds she sheds I'm constantly having to sweep because of this hair um so I won't even say it's because I cut the webs like it just the hair sheds it, it's she's a shedder um but without the shedding and I know that's like shedding is a big part of it but without the shedding if the hair didn't shed this hair would be perfect like the hair would be amazing again you get what you pay for so if you are wanting some you know fairly inexpensive straight hair to keep like as a wig on the side for you or everyday use then I would definitely suggest well I don't want to say if I would definitely suggest, but I would suggest this sh this hair. Just know it's going to shed or you really need to seal the wefts because this will shed. It does hold a curl. I can put a picture of my hair curled up. Um, it does hold a curl for the most part. It was actually curled before I straightened it yesterday and the curl was still there even though I hadn't been wearing it for a while. The curls and waves are still there so it holds a curl pretty well. The closure is another con for me simply because I am on the lighter complexion and the closure was a little bit dark. I guess it was like a medium brown lace and for me that's too dark for me so I did have to like manipulate the lace I did bleach the knots and I also used some like foundation and um, eyeshadow to help with the closure like the color of it because it is just a little too dark for me um, so yeah I think that that's about it it just the closure and the shedding the closure doesn't shed that bad it's just the hair like and I'm pretty sure it's the bottom lace because even with it being straight like the hair was definitely thicker than this because this is four bundles like and I'm pretty sure I you yeah I used all four bundles in this hair and you would think it would be just a little bit thicker it is straight hair but but yeah I think that's all I have to say about this hair I hope you all enjoyed this review hopefully this helps you because I didn't see a whole bunch of reviews on this hair so I wanted to make sure I at least shared a little bit about it um so if you want some quick bundles that are inexpensive for the most part and longer lengths definitely check this company out just make sure that you really seal the wefts with some Gorilla Groove Girl because this this wig sheds this hair sheds okay thank you all so much for watching I will see you all in my next video bye guys